Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Baby Name Sunday. Now this week's baby name list is going to be a piggyback on a list that I did two weeks ago, which today we will be doing some cool baby names trending just outside the top 1000s in 2023 for boys. So these are gonna be some trendy baby name ideas for boys that you're going to want to add to your baby names list if you're wanting to keep things a little bit more unique. Now let's get into the name list. One of my favorite surnames is Watson, spelled W-A-T-S-O-N, Watson. This one's kind of mysterious, always had this feel to it, and this one means watchman. Cedric, spelled C-E-D-R-I-C, Cedric. This one has been slowly climbing on the charts. It's also a Celtic rooted name, meaning bounty. Then we have the wonderful name Harlow, spelled H-A-R-L-O-W. Harlow for your little boy. This is so unique and one of those great gender neutral names that works for everyone. It's an English surname and it means Rocky Hill or Army Hill. Case, spelled K-A-S-E, Case. This has also been climbing a little bit. It's an English surname meaning case maker. I have Oakland, spelled O-A-K-L-A-N-D, Oakland. Guys, there is something about the name Oak and any name that has Oak in it, I find it's just one of the coolest nature names ever for both boys and for girls, but especially for boys, Oakland, like it just sounds so cool. It's a place name, it's a surname, and it means oak tree land. Time for something really kind of quirky and fun, guys, that is just outside the top 1000s is the name Rowdy, spelled R-O-W-D-Y, Rowdy. And this one is a word name, tons of word names have been popping up, and this one means high spirited. We have the sweet name Sunny, spelled S-U-N-N-Y, Sunny. This one's adorable. It's one of those nickname style names, kind of vintage as well, and it means sunshine or your little sun. Then I have Merrick, spelled M-E-R-R-I-C-K, Merrick. I actually know of this being used for both boys and for girls, so it really could be a gender neutral name kind of tomboy ask for a girl. And this one is an Anglo-Welsh rooted name, meaning fame and power. A great one here is Foster, so F-O-S-T-E-R, Foster. Very sweet and soft in sound. And this one's an English occupational name, meaning forester. We have Weston, spelled W-E-S-T-Y-N, Weston. The O-N ending is within the top 1000s, but the Y-N isn't, so this works. <laughs> and this one is an English rooted name meaning from the Western town. Now, if you guys have made it this far in the list and you are loving the names, please do consider subscribing down below. Hit the big red button down there. And also right below that, I believe it is, there is a thumbs up button that you guys can click on. It really helps push the video out so more parents or people can see this video. So if you guys can even just do that, that would be so amazing. And maybe leave a comment down below of some of your favorite names so far that you have been loving on the list. All right, moving on here, if you have a Brian in the family, a great kind of modernish sounding one here is Bryant, spelled B-R-Y-A-N-T, Bryant. This one is an Irish rooted name with a wonderful, powerful meaning of strong, virtuous, and honorable. Next, I have a couple kind of nature-esque names. So we have the name Stone, spelled S-T-O-N, an E stone. This one is a nature rocky name, but it is also a surname. I also have cedar, spelled C-E-D-A-R, cedar, a little bit more gender neutral. And this one's a really sweet nature tree name, but a cedar tree actually symbolizes greatness, nobility, and strength. Short and sweet here, we have Jed, spelled J-E-D, Jed. This one is too cool, especially with those three letter names that have been really popping up and kind of on the rise for popularity. This one's really great if you want some biblical roots as it's from Jedediah, but it's an Arabic rooted name meaning beloved of the Lord. I have Rocky, spelled R-O-C-K-Y, Rocky. This one's super fun and peppy. It's a vintage name as well. I think it's too cool and it's an Italian and English rooted name meaning rock or rest. 
I have another three letter name here, which is Van, spelled V-A-N, Van. This one's a Dutch rooted name and can kind of be like a surname as well. Like a lot of Dutch surnames have like Van something. So I think this is really cool as it means of. I also have Shy, spelled S-H-A-I, Shy. This is so adorable so sweet and soft. I feel like I would more so use this for a boy just because of the sweetness to it, but it definitely could be used for the girls as well. And this one's a Hebrew rooted name meaning gift. We have the cool and total vintage classic Wilson, spelled W-I-L-S-O-N, Wilson. This has an amazing amount of nicknames will willis willie um wills even will be as well there's so many great nicknames that come about from this one and it's an english rooted name meaning resolute protector all right for another italian rooted name here we have aurelio spelled a-u-r-e-l-i-o Aurelio. And again, a ton of wonderful nicknames for this one. You have Elio, you even can do Leo as well. And this one's Italian rooted, like I mentioned, meaning the golden one. Then speaking of gold or something more precious, we have the name Taj, spelled T-A-H-J, Taj. And this one's an Arabic rooted name, meaning crown. All right, Irish rooted name here, guys. One of my favorites is Cullen, spelled C U. L-L-E-N, Cullen. This one is so cool and it means holly tree. Then I have Lev, spelled L-E-V, Lev. And this one has been definitely, I've been seeing it more used. I think it's just the edginess to it, the sound of it, Lev. It's just like so cool, like what is your name, you know? And Lev is a Hebrew and Russian rooted name and it has amazing meanings. It means heart, or it means lion. Another surname here, guys, is Wiley, spelled W-I-L-E-Y, Wiley. This one is a Scottish, German, and English rooted name, meaning resolute protection. I have the wonderful name Mars, M-A-R-S, Mars. This is one of those ones I would 100% use in a heartbeat, and it's a planet name, but it's also the Roman mythology god of war. So you have lots of power behind it, but you have a little bit of charm because the Roman god has this kind of love symbolism behind him. So I think it makes him super sweet, but such an incredibly handsome sounding name, Mars or Marzi as a nickname. I have Noe, spelled N-O-E, Noe. This one is actually a diminutive or alternative to the name Noah. It's derived from that one. So maybe if you find that Noah has been a little bit popular, it's definitely within the top like 20 names, 10 names for boys. This is a wonderful alternative guys and it also means rest and repose. Next up is the name Quest, spelled Q-U-E-S-T, Quest. Now just like Mars, I think Quest for a sibling name to Mars is just something out of this world. Like it just feels so cool and modern. Um, I definitely would use Quest myself. It's a word name and it means seeking a mission. Riggs, spelled R-I-G-G-S, Riggs. This is another one of those English surname names that have, are really cool with that double G there, Riggs, or even Briggs as well. Both of those two kind of play hand in hand. And this one means one who lives on a ridge. Now, before I move on with the rest of the list here, I have a few more names. I do want to mention if you guys are in a rut with names at all, I do offer one-on-one -on -one name consultations. So if you would like me to curate and create a specialized name list just for you, please send me an email. I'll have the email right here, but I'll also have it linked down in the description where you guys can send me, um, email me any questions. And you can also go DM me over on Instagram as well, if that makes it any easier. Now, time for the last few names on the list. So Next up, we have the name Nile, spelled N-I-L-E, Nile, just like the Nile River. <gasps> I think this is a really cool name here, and it's also an Irish-rooted name, meaning champion. Another four-letter name is Thor, spelled T-H-O-R, Thor, very powerful. This is actually, I can honestly say, Thor is my very first name that I ever fell in love with other than Max. 
Max and Thor were my top names since when I was like, I think four or even three years old. Like I was just like, I love these names. Like I love them so much. So this one is kind of near and dear to my heart. And Thor is the Norse god of thunder, strength, and rain. I have the name Kaza, spelled K-H-A-Z-A, Kaza. This is a really cool sounding name. Um, really great for just outside the top 1000s. This one means treasure. And for an alternative for the girl, because I personally love these two names. There's Kaza for a boy. You can totally do that for a girl as well. But there's also Kenza, K-E-N-Z-A for a girl. I'm just gonna add that in here because they both mean treasure or treasure chest. And I think they're just stunning names. I also love the name Tyree, spelled T-Y-R-E-E, -E, Tyree. And this one is a Scottish name that's actually inspired by an island that's off the west coast, yes, west coast, of Scotland, which I thought was really cool, and Tyree means land. Then that brings me to my final name on today's names that are just outside the top 1000s for boys that are so cool that you need to add to your names list. We have the name Blaine, spelled B-L-A-I-N-E, Blaine. This has this effect on me that's just like, oh wow, your name is Blaine. Like, I think it's just so cool. It's a great Blake alternative, and it can work as a Blair alternative as well. Blake, Blair, and Blaine, they all have that same kind of sound to it, that BL at the beginning, and I think it's just so cool. I don't know, I really personally love these style names. They just have that really modern sound to them. And Blaine is an Irish and Scottish rooted name meaning slender or angular, so. That is it with today's list. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you guys found some names to add to your own personal list. Let me know what your favorites are. I'm very interested to see like which ones you would personally use, which ones you're kind of surprised at that they're just outside the top 1000s. Anyways, make sure you guys are subscribed. Make sure you guys are hitting that button down below. Join the community on here as I upload names lists every single Sunday, um, every single week. And I will see you guys next Sunday now with another baby names list. Now you guys take care, stay safe and stay warm. Bye.